morning good morning people of god i pray that your day be blessed in the name of jesus i pray that your week is also blessed and understand that you determine well what success looks like for your life right you determine what success looks like for your life godliness with great um godliness with contentment is great gain what success looks like for you may be different than what success looks like for me nobody i don't know what you're praying and asking god for while you're in the earth you know you maybe just want to live on a piece of land that's paid for you know have all your debts paid off and have make generate income where you can just relax like what my elder said the other day ride off into the sunset relax for the rest of your days um you know, in the earth, that may be what you want to do. You know, my six, I got a 68 year old elder who's a very close friend, like a father to me. And um, he runs around here like Speedy Gonzalez. Sometimes we meet up at work, we work together and he, you, you wouldn't know um, he's 68 age is just a number these days because he's fit. He's moving all the time. He's all in the sun sometimes working and going, you know, um, but what success looks like for one of us is is not always the same for the other. There's some who have worked and done everything that they wanted to do. They have a lot of skills and they just want to travel for the rest of the days of the earth and uh, enjoy life. And then there are some of us, we feel like we just have this calling on our lives to, you know, to help folk or to go out into the earth and, you know, learn how to be more self-sufficient and resourceful and, you know, just do what we, you know, um, uh, feel like we're called to do on a daily basis and live a life of independence. And that's it, you know, and whatever you feel like success is for you, that's what determines your level of success. Don't allow anyone to come into your life and manipulate you. Um, try to uh, capitalize off of your ignorance. Pray about everything. Stay in the word of God. Jesus has already came and walked this earth and left, and he's already overcome this world. You know, you'll have some people that'll tell you, you know, if you want to follow Jesus, sell everything you have and, and follow them. You know, you have a lot of wolves in sheep clothing that literally tell people that sell everything and follow me, you know, give your last, you know. Um, but really, God makes his people self-sufficient, independent, and success is what you determine i feel like when we are chasing after other human beings and we want what they got um sometimes we we can easily be manipulated or tricked you know because there's a lot of trickery going on there's a lot of falsehood going on we are content in our own lane you know we'll be all right success is what we define it what it looks like to us not the next human being right so have a blessed day in Jesus' name. Go out into the world and let your light shine. Be happy. Be content. Godliness with contentment is great gain, right? Stay in the word for yourself. Getting to know the word for yourself will help you move around. All the trickery, all the wolves in sheep clothing, right? All the schemers and scammers. It will help you move around all of that. May your day be blessed. May everything you put your hands to be blessed in the name of Jesus. If nobody has told you that they love you today, then you already know your little country bunk and sister loves you. We are the light of the world, baby. Let's don't never let our lights grow dark. Let's keep shining bright. And we know that the blood of Jesus is sure. Our friend, our brother, our savior. That blood is the only blood that has power.